Good morning, everyone. My name is Neil Marsh. I'm Professor of Chemistry and Biological Chemistry. I chair the Faculty Senate, and I carry the big stick in graduation. And today, on behalf of the entire faculty, I congratulate all of you graduating today. Well done. But before you, yes, you can give yourself a round of applause. But before you leave, I want you to consider these five words. It isn't easy being green. Now, I'm not referring to our friends in East Lansing. <laughs> Rather, as some of you may recognize, these are the words of the late 20th century philosopher and beloved sock puppet, Kermit the Frog. Scholars have debated the meaning of his words. Seriously, that's actually true. But I believe Kermit was referring to the challenge facing our environment. In just the space of my lifetime, the world's population has more than doubled. And for the first time in human history, the stability of nature can no longer be taken for granted. Indeed, human activity has so profoundly impacted the Earth that we have created a new geological epoch, the Anthropocene. One consequence is that Kermit and his fellow amphibians are now among the many endangered species on our planet. Now, I was born around the time President Kennedy challenged Americans to ask, not what your country can do for you, but what can you do for your country? Well, today, I have an altogether bigger ask of you. Ask not what your planet can do for you. Well, if you think about it, that's not even a very sensible question. But ask what you can do for your planet. Thank you. Now, I'm inspired to make this planet-sized request, not just because I enjoyed the applause just then, but looking across this big house, I see a remarkable group of new graduates gathered here from across the planet. Today, we graduate majors in an amazingly diverse array of disciplines and subjects, from across the biological and physical sciences, from the social and political sciences, from the arts and humanities, from engineering, medicine, business, law, and many more. In short, I see a group of people whose talents, energy, intelligence, and passion have planet-changing potential. You're the people we need to make discoveries, to invent green technologies, and build a new sustainable infrastructure. You're the people we need to reimagine economies based on sustainable businesses, to enact green policies to protect the environment. You're the people we need to communicate the urgency of this task and inspire us to action. You're the people we need to champion new ideas, change minds, and just as importantly, touch hearts. Now, I know that as you embark on your chosen careers, you're unlikely to have saving the planet as a line item in your job description. But the truth is, we're all going to need to live a lot greener. And no, it won't be easy. It will be essential. So as you go, I ask not that you go blue, I ask that you go planet blue. <laughs>